creatures are climbing out of the catacombs, as monstrous as you can imagine. They come when the lights don't burn, to the lands that had not yet recovered from their first invasion, where people suffer without the protection of the Holy Church, where hope dies first. These creatures have already devastated the underlying lands, and they will come again and again until the human race is destroyed. You cannot come to terms with them. You can only kill. And we are the ones who kill them on forest roads, on the wastelands, at the ruins of cities, wherever our help is needed. We will come. We will tear them up. We will fight until the last one lies down dead. Out of the way, you bastard. My hammer is near. Have to find... is near. Have to find... Okay, I have that. Should find the carry. It probably didn't go.
get to die, bastard! Say something? No, I guess. These aqueducts used to carry pure water. Luxury by the standards of our religion. Now it's not like that. Aqueducts are destroyed. And this place has become a swamp. What is there? Something small. Red. Baby! This creature ate the child! away my village, killed everyone. I prayed that the hunters would come, but no one helped. How did you get saved? My husband had a carriage. When the ground shook, we immediately ran with the children. But the cameras were faster. It's strange that they're chasing you. They rarely go after the weak-blooded. 
were just a hungry hunter. They ate everyone I knew. I don't know any villages nearby. This village of yours must be very small. What was the name of it? Estendorf. I haven't heard of such a thing. Anyway, we didn't even have a chapel. I think the omniscient cardinals did not know about Mistendorf either. Then came the Kemrits. And... And it's all... over. There's nothing else out there, Hunter. I saw the body of your child. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Don't. Do not say anything. I still have a daughter. Hunter, save her at least. I will save both of you. Get up. Just be careful and let's go. I'll get you out of here and take you to a safe place. Trust me. Don't, Hunter. I want it to be over. You know, in the morning the sun was shining and it was so Quiet. So calm. I can still see it. I can't forget it. But I can't think of it either. It pains me, Hunter. Do you know what pain means? Pray, Oz, the Lightbringer will give you strength. Pray? What for? Will it bring my child back? No, Hunter. You know yourself that it will not. And no god will give me forgiveness. It's my fault that I didn't save my boy. My husband protected him to the last. He covered Josh with himself. I saw it. I let them both down. I drove like crazy. Thought it'd save us from that thing. What kind of creature? The one with the two heads. You followed us through the thicket. Huge. Gray as a corpse. I swear, Hunter. That was it who drove the carriage onto this road. She's smarter than the others. She knew exactly what she was doing. I guess the creature didn't kill me. Just to lure you into a trap. Wait, are you saying it's here? I don't know, Hunter. But it's somewhere around. I feel it.
you were right. The creature is different. I didn't even know they could talk. Gwen? You will speak. You listen. Just listen. You will survive. You must. For yourself. For the daughter. I know what you feel. I also had children. I know you can't hear me, but you hang in there. Sooner or later, we will find the healer. Just hold on. Do not die. We need to find the wheel. Thank <laughs> you. 
can't hear me, but it's even easier. Do you have any of these? Hi, 
Hush, hush, traveler. I can't see well, but I can see your white hair. So you are a hunter. You look not particularly good. But we can fix it. I have a lot of stuff. There are bandages and elixirs and something to improve your Lenten mug. I'm not joking, Greybeard. The girl is dying. Well, let's see. Hmm. The wound is serious, but nothing particularly terrible. Now I'm going to make up the potion. Just a minute, just a second. Oh no, just just a minute. One one more minute. Um, um, one one more thing. Wait a minute. <laughs> Can you go faster? All is ready. She will live. Don't be afraid. She will fall asleep even deeper than before, but she will wake up a new person. So take a breath. Now there is no need to rush. And, and what's the use of rushing, really? Look around. The world is on fire. Are you saying there's no hurry? I hasten to the capital of Gilmeth. Forget it. There is no way to get to the capital today. The city is practically under siege. Evil spirits are roaming in droves. I don't give free advice, but under the circumstances, go find a simpler place. Any village will fit if there is a cathedral and a fire is burning. The girl needs rest, and you need work. And where does the hunter look for it, if not in the church? You should find an older cathedral, and one with thicker walls. Stay there until everything settles down. And so it happened, Hunter. I know such a place. Are you a traveling merchant? Doctor? Who are you? Well, that's a question I myself would like to know. Who am I? These books and healers' vials, it's all for the soul in size job. And no matter how deep I look into the past, there's only darkness. Just like me, I don't like looking back either. No, Hunter, you don't understand. I really don't remember anything. The roads are dangerous now. We should find a shelter. Of course. There is a small town nearby. The Cambridge have already passed there. Everything is ruined, but the walls are still standing, and there are some houses. There is also a cathedral. What would we be without it? The place is strong, prayerful. Even if you die, it will instantly resurrect you. Thank you. You wait to thank, Hunter. I say the Kemrids trampled there, notably the town is practically ruined. Even the dogs! They fled! Only the cathedral remained. The fire, of course, went out, but the Kemrid creatures sense the power there, so they avoid this place. Cathedral, that is. The place seems to fit. Can you show me the way to town? I'm not going anywhere! Then let's get to the wagon. Time is precious. Hunter, drive as fast as possible. I feel the idea getting closer still. I'm looking at you. How did you survive here, Greybeard? You have no carriage, no weapons. Alone in the forest with all your books and potions. <clears throat> Who knows, Hunter? I noticed a long time ago they don't care about me. Why? No one knows. And yet, it's weird.
the brakes on that? We're on the spot! Is this the city you were talking about? It's completely ruined. You're right, but the cathedral is still standing. We should visit it. Cathedral? Was I sleeping? How do you feel, Gwen? Surprisingly clean. Where are we? In some old town. Let's hide here until everything calms down. And you look cheerful for a dying one. And the wounds healed. A strange thing. Let's hurry up, Hunter. If we talk too much, we won't get to the cathedral. You're right. Lead. You didn't lie. The cathedral is still standing, but it hardly helps. The damn town is just teeming with creatures. Was that your plan to drag us into the middle of nowhere? Hot or cold, if you get the defense, then this is the right place. Let's stay here, and then we'll think about it. Hunter, we need to check the cathedral just in case some creature crawled through. I could watch the entrance. You better get well. No need. I'm fine, Hunter. I don't know what was in that elixir, but... I can hold a gun. That's good, girl. Coming, Hunter? Yes, I'm going, but here's the thing, old man. If you have a plan, I don't understand it at all. You wait a little, and you will see everything. Follow me. Keep up. <laughs> so you know how to light fires, but how? Don't know. It's like breathing. I know how, and then that's it. You better take a look at that stained glass window. Look, your face is on the glass. You are now under the protection of God himself. If you die, he will immediately bring you back to life. So you have a plan. Maybe you'd like to tell us at last what you have in mind. Of course, Hunter, of course. You know how to light fires. Are you a priest? A warlock? Neither one nor the other, girl. I don't know who I am at all. I promised the hunter to discuss a plan. If you're ready, it's time. Let's discuss what to do next. I was just thinking about it. There is a fortress wall with brasses around the city. If the holy fires are lit there, then the city will certainly be recaptured, but... That's just... what? Lighting the fires is not easy, girl. By the way, Kimrids, of course, are afraid of fires, but as soon as the braziers are lit, the creatures will trample from all the cracks, like stirring up a beehive. And I'm needed here. That's right, Hunter. Here in the town, there are a couple places where they hid. Drive them away, and I will light the fire, and then they will attack. I will gather strength in the cathedral so that all the fires can be lit at once. Can you watch the entrance, girl? I'll cover you as long as I have ammo. So we've decided. The girl is here. I'm in the cathedral. Hunter, as soon as you finish with the creatures in the city, go to the gate. And God help us. It's 
you, Hunter. I'll make sure they don't kill the old. Perhaps you wanted to ask something. I will prepare for battle. If we survive. Strange place. This is 
is not very noticeable. How did you get here? What do you think, Hunter? He went down to the basement and walked away. I thought I'd survive the invasion as it happened before, but this time it was different. Explain. Take a look at the fortress wall, Hunter. It's almost complete. Do you see what I mean? So they snuck into the city from the inside. Exactly. I even get scared a bit. I thought they would notice, but it was all right. Sounds like you know the area well. How are you from here? I was born here, and all my ancestors are also from here. And my smithy was here. Was. It's unlikely that it survived. It's best not to stay in that tunnel for long. Let's get out of here before we're cornered. As you say, church man. Strange place.